Okay, so here we are in Ableton Live. Let me just stop that. Here we are in Ableton Live. We're going to do a tutorial on this today. Um, so, where we're going to start is by setting all of this up. I just threw in a couple clips there, audio clips, um, just to do a little demo on it. Uh, but first, um, to set up your sound card, I'm just using the internal sound card at the moment. Um, because I do not need to queue at this point. Um, so what you're going to do is you're going to go up to options all the way down to preferences and here we go it brings up a new window. Now what you want to do is on the left side, oh by the way this is Ableton Live 6 um, and Live 5 looks a little different than this uh, but nonetheless there is an audio tab that you can select Okay and here we are this brings us to the audio preferences and what we're gonna look for is audio output device and what I have running right now is the internal sound card uh, this iMic isn't hooked up but that is another option that I have um, then what you can do is you can go to your output configuration and then check to make sure both of these are on. If they aren't, then nothing, no sound will um, come out of your sound card. Anyway, go down to OK. OK that. Fail to open. OK, yes. Um, you may get this message if your sound card is not plugged in. Right now, I don't have the iMic USB audio um, sound card plugged in. Um, so this is why this is coming up. And that should happen if your sound card is not plugged in once again okay so here it is uh, your sound cards all ready to go um, if you do not if you're you're under the audio tab and you do not see your sound card um, try restarting Ableton Live and checking again uh, other than that you may have something um, other external sound cards you may have something that looks something like this this is the M Audio 410 and um, we may get this set up a little later uh, but for now I'm just going to be using the internal sound card um, if you have an external sound card something like this or let me get this or like this this is an iMic uh, this is what I use on the road sometimes. Um, you can go to the website uh, that um, manufactures the product, and you, they can they usually give you drivers to download and install. So for this, this is the M Audio Firewire 410, and what I can do is I go to the website mAudio.com m-audio.com and download their drivers and install them. And then once you've installed the drivers you can restart live start it up again and it should be under there. If not um, if you're watching this and you're still having problems please feel free to ask me um, how to set this up for your specific sound card. And now we are going to go back into live and start jamming.